And good morning, everybody. Your lines are muted, so you can go about your business now. It is Tom Chenault, and it's the Hair on Fire call on a fantastic and wonderful Thursday morning. I hope you're up and rocking, and I hope that each and every one of you walked into the mirror this morning, and you looked at yourself, and you said, you know what? Today is here. Yesterday is gone, and we are living no more of our life in the rearview mirror. We are going forward, we're going to go fast, and we're going to take the mountain, and we're going to take some people with us. The neat thing about this business is I'll guarantee you, as you look back at that person in the mirror, you're not alone. There's a lot of people standing there looking in that mirror this morning saying, what am I going to do with my life? I don't like my job. I don't like how much money I make. I don't like leaving my family. I have been alive on this planet for X amount of years, and it wasn't set up to look like this. I'm not supposed to be where I'm living. I'm not supposed to be what I'm doing. When I was 21 years old and I graduated from college or I didn't graduate from college, my business plan was not to have my life look like this. My business plan was to have my life look like adventure, like fun, like romance, like money, like travel, like time, like everything fun. And now I've got to figure out how to do that because the track, the path I took, it might have had some rewards, but it just didn't work. And I want each and every one of you to say, man alive, I know that the track that I wanted to go on back there is attainable. I just took the wrong path, the wrong fork in the road. And all I've got to do is rewind it. And I've got to take some people with me. So go back to that fork in the road and grab your four friends that you love the most and say to them, you know what? I've got an idea. There's a company called Longevity. There's a comp plan called Longevity. There's some products called Longevity. There's a man named Dr. Joel Wallach, and I want to follow him, and I want to build an, a, a dynasty with four people, and you are one of those four people. I love you. You've been in my life. You're somebody I believe in, and I want to jump in the foxhole with you, and I want to take the mountain, and I'm guaranteeing you one thing right now. I, you won't be alone, and you start talking to four people like that every day, and you say, I told you to talk, interview two people with a copy shop interview every day without talking to them about longevity. Before you start talking product, before you start talking comp plan or anything else, do the interview. And once you get those four people identified that you want to go, you take them where they want to go in their life. I don't care who it is. I asked some people yesterday, what's important to you? And it was the most amazing thing what was important to the, you, the, them because it wasn't that important to me. And if I hadn't asked them what was important to them, I would have had an agenda of mine on them. That's not what you want to do. You want to find out what people's dreams are, whether they want to travel, whether they want to garden, whether they want to sing in bars, whether they want to sleep when the wind blows, whether they don't want their eyes to pop up in the middle of the night and say, I'm not happy. I want you to have a life that you designed when you were at the top of your game, when you said everything I touch turns to gold, everything I believe in comes into man of, into reality. That You've had those days in your life. Think about when you were a little kid and you were playing sports or you decided to be a pilot or whatever it was you decided to do and there was no stopping you because your dream was so big and your goals were so high and there was nothing on this planet that was going to take you away from those dreams. What happened? Think about where you started getting stopped. It was probably life, but it wasn't longevity. It wasn't network marketing. It wasn't this company or this comp plan or the management of the team. It was basically a break in belonging. And I know one thing that we can do. We can bring that belonging back. Every one of us can be a team. Danny Sutherland called me, wrote me a beautiful email. He's on his vacation. He's out there halfway across the country. And you know what? He's still coming home in the nighttime and watching the Facebook videos. He's looking at Masters of Enrollment on Facebook, and he's still in the game because he knows his dream is bigger than the vacation that he's on. And each and every one of us have to think that way. So many of you tell me these things. Oh, guess what? This is happening in my life. My son's got a baseball game. I've got this event I've got to do. I've got this call I've got to make. And I can't do the longevity business call or I can't do it. Well, I'm going to tell you, those things were un important enough to put on your calendar and organize your life around. When was the last time you took your two interviews 
and everything that you should organize your life around in longevity, when was the last time you put that on your day timer? Where it was no kidding, like it was more important than anything else. Because when your goals and your dreams get more important than anything else versus all the garbage we do during the day, I'll guarantee you, man alive, I gotta get these calls out of the way because I get home, I gotta go home and watch American Idol. That is wrong. You're organizing your life around a TV show. I'm thinking about organizing your life around a dream, a goal, something so much bigger than you are. There is nothing stopping you. And all you do is plug in. I drove down to Fort Collins. I met these unbelievable people down there last yesterday afternoon. And it was so nice to talk to them because they've got dreams. They've got goals. They've got something in mind that is bigger than they are. What's going on with you today? And you're looking in that mirror and you're saying, I want to make $20,000 a month. I want to have a life. If you want to make $20,000 a month, you've got to find four people that believe that you're going to get there. And you've got to get those four people to $5,000 a month each. And they've got to be people that you can lock arms with, that you can partner with, that you can love, that can lead. Who's it going to be? You're going to go to grab a Greg Arnold. You're going to go grab an Erlene Downey. You're going to grab a Lisa Barney. You're going to grab a Christy Albrand. You're going to grab a Mark Cottle. You're going to grab, and I'm pulling people right off my top line here. I'm, yeah, that's what I want you to do. The names I'm bringing are the lead. I'm talking about leaders and the leaders that you've decided to jump in the foxhole with. And when you get those leaders, it's your job to teach them to train their leaders. Your job, you, not my job, your job. If you call me and say, Tom, I want you to build a business for me, I'm going to tell you no. You tell me I want to build a business with me, we are partners. But when it comes to building a business with you, that means I'm not going to build it for you. You've got to do your part, I'll do my part. That's what I love about Greg and Patty Arnold, man. I know right now they've been up for an hour. I know right now that they have been working for the next hour, for the last hour, and I know they're going to be working for the next 10. And they're going to be working on their dream, and my job is to support them. That's what you do in this business. I'll guarantee you, it takes you a long time to get these legs built up, but it's worth it. Larry Sane, Char, Erlene, Lisa, people on this call have been in it for more than 10 years, and they've all got a little pin. Guess what that pin says? I've made over a million bucks with Longevity. Has one company given any one of you people on this call a pin that says, I've earned a million dollars with Longevity? Probably not, but those people have. And I'll guarantee you, it's just the first million. There's more money coming, and each and every one of you have that dream. But you've got to find your four people. You've got to build that infrastructure. You've got to know that you've got it in you like there is no tomorrow. And if you do that, if you just believe in the process, and it's not going to happen tomorrow. I got an email this morning from a guy that says, man, alive by 2012, I've got to have this done. 5,000 people. I love that goal because he's being realistic. He's going to get it faster than that, but I'll guarantee you, at least he isn't thinking this is some overnight fix. This is a process, but inside of that process is conviviality. There is fun. There is team. You are going to love being with your people. Build a team you love and then go do stuff with them. That's what's so exciting and be a part of. Nothing's worse than being a, not being a part of something. Nothing's worse than just standing around going, man, alive, I'm on the street corner and I've got all this money and i got all this stuff going on, but I don't have any friends. I want you to have it all. I want you to be able to participate like you've never participated before. If you look at Facebook last night, you can see Denise had a beautiful dinner party. Was it a dinner party for two? No, it was a dinner party for about 10 because you want to surround yourself with friends all the time. I want you guys to have a great life. I want you to have money. I want you to have time. I want you to have fun. I want you to have health. I want you to have teamwork. And I want you to have responsibility and integrity. Each and every one of you can do it. You can do it starting today. I love every one of you guys with all my heart. Today we take it on like we've never taken it on before. Start right now. Look in that mirror and say to that guy, look at him. I am not waiting for tomorrow to do this. I'm going to find two people. I'm going to bring them in my business. I'm going to learn so I can teach them. And there is nothing stopping me. I love you guys with all my heart. Tomorrow morning, same time, same station, I'm bringing you all back.